It is listed as one of the engineering marvels of the world. 80 years ago, the Hoover Dam tamed the mighty Colorado River, and it is something to look at, man. I tell you what, you stand up next to this thing and you say, wow. Well, have you been to this on your way to Vegas? Have you taken the tour? Chances are you didn't learn these five secrets. Hoover Dam secret number five. There's a grave right along the main road that takes traffic over the dam. What we're looking at here is the um, grave of the Hoover Dam mascot. That's right. Hoover Dam had a mascot, a little dog who a worker found as a puppy. He roamed the dam site as it was being built and greeted visitors in the first year the dam was open. He was accidentally run over by a work truck in 1941. A little plaque and cement cover marked that gravesite. This is, th this is where the dam construction workers buried him. Uh, everybody loved this dog. Hoover Dam secret number four. A small piece of World War II overlooks the dam. See this little building? Immediately after Pearl was bombed, they built that pillbox. That's right. This is a gun emplacement built just after Pearl Harbor was bombed. Its mission? To protect the dam from air attack. And the idea was that if a Japanese bomber or a German bomber somehow got that in here, they'd be able to shoot it down before it could destroy the dam or damage the dam. Right. Though it would have been very unlikely that they could have done much damage to the dam anyway, because right. that's really one big, huge hunk of concrete. Right. Hoover Dam secret number three. There's a four-story office building right inside the Hoover Dam. So those who head to their damn job work in their dam office. People may not know that there's like office space here at the dam. Uh, that's absolutely correct. We have about four floors of office space in the dam itself. Most of the workers that uh, maintain uh, the dam on a daily basis have office space, uh, computers uh, right in the dam itself. Hoover Dam secret number two is what crews did with a lot of their construction debris. Another interesting thing you may not know about Hoover Dam, behind me here as the road, this is on the Arizona side, zigzags up. It's built on what they call spoil from the dam. So basically they had to dig out a huge section of this canyon to get the dam on bedrock and they were forced by law to do something with the spoil that wouldn't take away from the beauty of the dam. So what they did with this pile is put it over here on the Arizona side and made it a spot for the road to zigzag down. It was obviously a very clever way to meet the clause in their contract telling them that they needed to put it somewhere where it wouldn't detract from the views of the dam. And Hoover Dam secret number one, maybe the most impressive of all. 80 years after the dam opened, it continues to get stronger. Concrete cores were drilled in the dam back in 1995. Engineers found the concrete is continuing to harden, ensuring this engineering wonder of the world will do its job for a long time to come. And there are your five secrets. You want to see the dam in person? It's about a four-hour drive from Phoenix, and tours are offered just about every day. If you go there, make sure they tell you a little bit about those secrets.